Six months out from the Women's World Cup in New Zealand and Australia, starting July the 20th. And this week, Telemundo became the home of US Soccer's friendlies, plus other high-profile matches. So lots to look forward to on Telemundo in the lead-up to the Women's World Cup. and she's already planning her trip to the Women's World Cup this coming yes. summer for Telemundo. Tell us what you're looking forward to about the Women's World Cup. Oh, my gosh, everything. The game is going to be historic. I mean, it's the first time the Women's World Cup is going to be in two countries, New Zealand and Australia. It's the first time with 32 teams. I mean, it's going to be nostalgic. It's the last, probably the last one for uh, Marta, the greatest soccer player of all time. He actually plays here for... Lucy Bronze oh. from England. I mean, oh. it's going to be that the game is going to be tougher for the for the USA team. I mean, England just won the. Oh, you Euro. mean the European champions, England? Yes, yeah, exactly. Checking, that's what you mean. I know you're still dreaming about Chloe Kelly goal. I mean, Germany. It's going to be tougher for them, but it's going to be it's going to be amazing. It's going to be beyond greatness. It is. It is. It's coming this summer. We're going to watch Anna on Telemundo Deportes. Let's talk about an announcement which some people might have missed over the last week. Some more good news for you guys. Tell us more. Oh, we're now the home of the USA team, Wo woman, man. This week we have the men team again Ser against Serbia and then against oh Colombia. That's going to be a great game on Telemundo, both games. I, I did tell you she's the busiest woman in <laughs> football. Um, now, you are living here in Florida. This is where your family yes. is. This is where home is, where Telemundo Studios are. So you know all about the Premier League fans in Florida. Yeah. We've been to Miami. You were at the Miami Fan Fest as well. I know you're a fan fest. You've come to so many of them with us. This crowd, this Orlando crowd... take for granted that Florida fans would trust me. I used to live in Orlando. This was my first home, so I have a special... Uh, they're always in my heart. But Miami, you have. we have to go back to Miami. Oh, I'm, I'm not saying no to that. I'll head to Miami whenever you want. Also... Oh, no, no, no. no. Like wait, wait, hey, wait a minute. Oh I said you guys are good, but we have to go back to Miami. Don't mess with You Anna. see? Just you that, see? Don't mess with Floridians. Right. Don't mess with Floridians. Seriously, I'm learning that as every day goes by. Also, the weather's interesting. It's kind of cold oh, but it's humid. A, you cannot beat Orlando weather, right? No, no, no. I love Orlando weather because it's Florida, but you okay. get the cold, too. Can't, can't, even for a Brit, it's very yeah. strange. <laughs> Anna, thank you so much. Thank, thank, thank you. you to Anna Yorka. Hi there, I'm Rebecca Lowe, studio host for NBC's coverage of the Premier League. Don't forget to hit subscribe to watch more videos all season long. For even more Premier League content, from original series to live matches, head over to Peacock and be sure to tune in for Premier League mornings every weekend on USA Network and on Peacock. We will see you over there.